the objective of this given experiment is to detect foreign elements present in the given organic compound by Lazayan's test. Hydrocarbons and their derivatives in which covalently bonded carbon is the essential constituent are called organic compound. Methane, ethane, ethonic acid are some examples of it. Elements like nitrogen, sulfur and halogen which are less commonly present in the organic compound are called foreign elements. These elements are also known as heteroelements. The science test. In this method, a little amount of organic compound is fused with sodium metal in a fusion tube at a high temperature and extracted in distilled water. The resulting solution is the science extract or sodium extract. We prepare sodium extract because the elements in the organic compound are covalently bonded and water insoluble. Hence, they cannot be detected. But when fused with sodium metal, the given organic compound is converted into water-soluble ionic salt, hence they can be detected. The apparatus required are burner, tripod stand, fusion tube, funnel, porcelain basin, test tube, test tube holder, filter paper, tongue and spatula. The chemicals required are organic compound sample, a piece of sodium metal, ferrous sulfate, sulfuric acid, sodium hydroxide, ferric chloride, sodium nitroprusside, silver nitrate, and conch nitric acid. First, we need to identify the physical properties of organic compound. The state is crystalline solid, it is colorless, odorless, and insoluble in water. Take a small piece of dry sodium metal in a fusion tube. Heat over the burner until it melts with a shining surface and cool it. Add a pinch of organic compound to the cooled sodium metal. Heat the fusion tube until it becomes red hot. Plunge the red hot tube into a porcelain basin containing 10 ml of distilled water. Grind the mixture. Boil the mixture. Filter the solution. The clear filtrate obtained is known as sodium extract or lazayan's extract. Detection of nitrogen. Take 1 to 2 ml of sodium extract in a test tube. Make the solution alkaline by adding few drops of aqueous sodium hydroxide. Add few drops of freshly prepared ferrous sulfate solution. Dirty green precipitate is obtained. Boil the mixture and cool it. Add 2 to 3 drops of ferric chloride solution. Then add conch sulfuric acid. The presence of a greenish blue coloration or Prussian blue color proved that nitrogen is present in the given solution. The reaction involved in this experiment are sodium, carbon and nitrogen react to form sodium cyanide. Ferrous sulfate reacts with sodium hydroxide to form ferrous hydroxide and sodium sulfate. Ferrous hydroxide reacts with sodium cyanide to form ferrous cyanide and sodium hydroxide. Ferrous cyanide reacts with sodium cyanide to form sodium ferrocyanide. Sodium ferrocyanide reacts with ferric chloride to form ferric ferrocyanide. This is the compound that gives Prussian blue color. Add a few drop of sodium nitroprusside solution to about 1 ml of sodium extract. The appearance of violet or purple coloration indicates presence of sulfur. Since there is absence of violet or purple color, it is proved that sulfur is absent in the given solution. The second test to detect sulfur is lead acetate test. First of all, add 1 ml of acetic acid into 1 ml of sodium extract. Then add 2 to 3 drops of lead acetate solution. The appearance of black precipitate indicates presence of sulfur in the given solution. Since no black precipitate is formed, it is proved that sulfur is absent in the given solution. Detection of halogens. Add few drops of conch HNO3 into 2 ml of sodium extract. Boil it and cool it for a few minutes. Then add one to two drops of silver nitrate solution. The appearance of curdy white precipitate indicates presence of chloride and yellow precipitate indicates presence of bromide. 
Since no white or yellow precipitate is seen, it is proved that halogen is not present in the given solution. Hence, the foreign element present in the given organic compound was detected to be nitrogen by Lazayan's test. Sodium extract is boiled with concas NO3 because cyanide and sulfide impurities are removed out in the form of hydrogen cyanide and hydrogen sulfide respectively as shown in the reactions. Freshly prepared ferrous sulfate solution is used to make sodium extract because ferrous sulfate solution oxidizes to ferric sulfate after a long time which is useless for analysis as shown in the reactions.